Hey everybody, I'm Drew. And I'm Vince. And welcome back to some Zero Time Dilemma. Let's go ahead and pick up where we left off. <laughs> let's go ahead. <laughs> let's check out one of these other fragments. Okay. Uh, sure. Let's do this one. Why not? Jump to here. Let's clean up this C team that <laughs> we've got going on here. Yeah, yeah, you're almost done with C team. For now, anyway. For now, yeah. Poison. The infirmary. Uh, well, I guess we there. were locked <laughs> in here while we were unconscious. Huh? It opened. So that means we weren't locked in. But why are we here then? Hmm. Eighteen ten. Greetings, C team. How are you feeling? Zero. Before we begin. I shall tell you an old story. Seventeen years ago, a woman was killed. One day, about a month later, a male suspect was located and arrested for her death. He claimed innocence, but the jury found him guilty. The verdict could not be overturned, and thus the man was executed. In her grief, the man's wife took her own life. She left two children? We moved several years later. New DNA analysis results proved that the man's claims were true. He was falsely convicted. The true culprit remains at large. Their identity is still unknown. Life is simply unfair. Don't you think? Ah, uh, more of these pointless stories. Or was it a story about his backstory? Dun dun dun! Say, perhaps one day you woke up and found yourself injected with poison. Oh, I get it. That's not too odd to happen to someone. Oh, I think Just that's still pretty odd. <laughs> to you. Dun dun dun! So who gets what? the antidote? Mm. If you do nothing, the six of you will fall asleep. Only to never regain consciousness again. Six! Fuck you, asshole. <laughs> Atta boy, Jim Fuck Pei. you! <laughs> Find it. Good luck. We've been poisoned? I don't feel different, but I doubt he was lying to us just then. <sighs> we better get to finding this antidote. What's with I didn't rain? make it to today mm. just to end like this. I need to do what I'm here to do. I can't die. You're right. Let's all get through this together. We'll find the way to stay alive. Badass trio. Again. Yeah. <laughs> they get a lot of those uh, cool yeah. poses with the three of them. <laughs> yeah. I like this team. Right. <laughs> oh, boy. So, okay, here we go. Uh, so I, need, I, I need to use mouse and keyboard. Because my last six foot micro USB cable crapped out on me. Oh, that's sad. Yeah. That's okay. This is a pretty pointy, clicky kind of game, anyway. Yeah. Barcode reader. Uh, oh my god, this yes. thing. <laughs> so, it. So, uh, when, when you, we get to it, I'll explain. Okay. Oh, I'm excited. It's not, it's not that bad. Button thingy. <laughs> I don't know, but I'm guessing we're going to find out soon. Mm, probably. Probably within this episode. <laughs> I should hope so. <laughs> Ah, uh, stethoscope, that looks tickable. <laughs> <laughs> it was a boob joke. Oh, I get it. <laughs> I forgot I didn't examine this one. It's kind of weird that it's shaped like a pen. 
A little bit. It's kind of weird that they would make a toy barsco barcode scanner. Yeah. Like, <laughs> although I guess I had a Digivice that was basically a glorified barcode scanner. Yeah. But it was so much more than that. <laughs> you have got anything to say about the lab coat? <laughs> All men are perverts. <laughs> Apparently. Except Carlos. He just has a sister yeah. complex. <laughs> yeah, Car Carlos seems like he's pretty much on the up and up. Yeah. Although it's still not as good as the uh, elevator conversation from 999. Oh my god, that was beautiful. <laughs> like, who would even talk that way? But it's just, oh my god, it's so good. <laughs> I love that. Um... Okay, I'm not even gonna bother. Yeah. Guessing. So we need five codes. We need five codes. Shiny thing. A syringe. I like how they make it all sparkly up. so that you can see it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is a little fancy looking, isn't it? I always kind of spin it around, because I'm trying to do like the Phoenix right thing. Oh yeah. Where if you examine it a specific spot, you get something new. Yeah. Sometimes, I mean, sometimes they do have something that can give you a hint, like that round part in the pantry having that T-shaped hole. It's like, oh, that mm -hmm. might give you a clue of where it goes. I don't know. Yeah. Luminol spray. Oh. Okay. Speaking of Phoenix, right? <laughs> <laughs> wow, okay. <laughs> Am I a clairvoyant? You are. Bum, bum. Quick, who is zero? Junpei dies at the end. <gasps> Ooh. To be fair, Junpei dies like a lot of times <laughs> along the way. <laughs> I know, that 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 was a joke. <laughs> We're gonna uh, spray it. <laughs> I feel like even if it were luminol spray, it would suck to get it in your eyes. Probably, so yeah. That, that's not a great test. No. Hey, let me spray this in your eyes. If it stings, it's pepper spray. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, I'm just like spraying it around. Yeah. All right, book. <laughs> Too soon. <laughs> Those eyes of Carlos's profile. Yeah, they're so judgy. I do miss all like the animated sprites, like full body art from the mm. conversations. But I guess they have the animated cutscenes to make up for that this time. Yeah. Well, something's. Oh, it's a humidifier. Yeah. Let's check these drawers. Anything in here? Nope. Okay. <laughs> Absolutely nothing. <laughs> I do like that there are places that you can, like, examine that just don't have anything. Yeah. Makes it seem a bit more believable. Yeah. No. I, I didn't. <laughs> I didn't want... You did it! Okay. <laughs> cool. In blood. Five, two, eight. Um. I think it's. I don't know. They tell you if you examine it. I think. <laughs> he wouldn't bother to carve out Ong. Oh, he'd just say it. <laughs> All right, it's five, two, eight. Yeah. Nothing in that one. All right. Hold on here. Nothing. <laughs> All right. I'm just waiting for one of them to be wrong. <laughs> oh, cool. This, that, a thing. It's a cute puzzle.
Okay, in a minute. Let's <laughs> this. Nothing! Not really with unlocking them. But yeah. It's nothing! Oh, wait, no, not quite nothing. <laughs> a card. Picture of a syringe pointing at a candle. Okay. Well, that's weird, but I'll go ahead and do it anyways. <laughs> Ooh, woo, ho. Yeah, there's some blood. Oh, alright. Oh, I do that? Let's go ahead and do this. No, okay. Poke it at the candle. Okay. Well. Might be, yeah, might be time for that. Do this, yeah. <laughs> Cause lasting traumatic harm to kids. Okay. Put the puzzle together. Uh huh. Um. They basically uh, you just switch them. They they go in those six spots and then you just check if they're in the right places basically. Oh. Okay. All right. I think I. Yeah. It's kind of unintuitive. Yeah, so... I think the one on the left is... Yeah, there you go. You got it. Okay. <laughs> cool. Cool. Yeah. Something's coming out of it. <laughs> I wonder. Alright, well... At the very least, pretty sure I know that this goes here. Yeah. Hey. Okay, sure. Um, let's just go down the line. <laughs> <laughs> the results are in. You've got poison. <laughs> okay. Well, let's just go ahead and scan everybody, I guess. <laughs> Because why not? <laughs> Alright. We'll check it out in a second. Your turn, Akane! Results are in. Kind of. <laughs> yeah, you don't say. <laughs> and this, so this is why I groaned. It took me so freaking long to figure out, like, what to do here because they give you no instruction at all. Apparently, all you do is you hold it. You hold it down, you start at the left, you hold it down, and you scan it all the way across, and then you let go. And that's it. But, like, I, oh. it just took me a stupid long time to get that. I had to actually, like, look up a video walkthrough of this room just for that part. Yeah, that, Like, that I knew I needed to use obvious. the barcode scanner. Like, that much was obvious, but it's just, ugh. It's dumb. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, well... Open it up. Bottle of ink and a lug wrench. Okay. I'm with you, Akane. We definitely need this. <laughs> never. I will never focus. And lug wrench. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> alright, 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 right, right, hang on. You got the idea now. Oh. Well, you've had the idea huh? and then you stopped having the idea. Oh. 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 Now you got the idea. <laughs> yeah, no, no. I just wanted to, um... Drag it in the center. There oh, that's... Yeah. Okay. It's weird. 
Yeah, that's uh, right. No, I just wanted to double check the 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 card. Okay. Um. All right. Yes. Word. <laughs> That's not normally what cloth does when you put ink in it. <laughs> no. They look like candles. <laughs> ah. Oops. I wasn't trying to skip that. <laughs> Sorry. Right. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wrong item. Yeah. Yep. So annoying because it's like, okay, I get it now. Can you just take all of them off, please? <laughs> yeah. A four. Hey! Man, this is really elaborate. Okay. <laughs> no? Hey! The only item you haven't used yet. <laughs> <laughs> Do I actually have to listen for it or? Sort of. Visual helps. Yeah, a, a lot. Yeah, I was mostly going off the sound, but yeah, especially if this is a 3DS game, you don't want to make people have to like turn their volume all the way up. Yeah. Also, um, I guess, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, accessibility for deaf people. Yeah. They could contain an antidote. You found oh, it! Uh, that was it! That was it! Okay. Wow, that room was not bad. Yeah, that one was pretty short. Congratulations, C-Team. It appears you've successfully found the antidote. The poison must be circulating through and making you feel heavy right now. But do not worry. Your lives shall be spared if you drink 100 cc of the antidote within the case. The case? Uh, this case? It should be obvious that there are eight containers labeled A through H. Vials of liquid are within each of these containers. Only one container holds the antidote. The other seven are dummies. Oh, come on, <laughs> So if we're wrong, Will... Still, I am not so cruel. I shall give you a hint. Sitting beneath each button is a sample of the liquid stored within. It is only one cc, but it is enough to provide a clue to its validity. The antidote has a peculiar characteristic. Three minutes after you lick it, the tip of your tongue you have five minutes remaining. If my calculations are correct, the poison will have spread completely through you by then, and your life is forfeit. Which case will you open then? The choice 
Jesus, guys. What do we do? What the hell do we do? Maybe we should go left to right and lick each one. I'll take A. Carlos, grab B. Akane, you take C. No, we can't rely on that method to work. Why? It takes three minutes before we know anything either way. That would be all right if we picked the correct one, but if we didn't... We're all dead. So, what do we... Junpei, just calm down. There's a better way. First, Carlos. You need to lick E, F, G, and H. Next, Junpei. You lick samples C, D, G, and H. As for me, I'll take samples B, D, F, and H. What about A? We don't need to test that one. Why? We don't have time. Just do as I say. Process of elimination. All right. Yep. Let's trust Akane. There it is. You too? My tongue's gone numb too. Uh, I I don't feel anything. So Junpei was the only one who didn't. Then I think. Uh oh. Akane. Hey, what's wrong? What do you think's wrong? <laughs> uh, shit, our resistances. They must be different. <laughs> uh, it looks like the poison uh, got to her faster. So what should we do now? What was that method Akane came up with? We'll have to make the decision ourselves. The answer. What's the answer? I Let me look at the log. E, F, G, and H. Junpei had C, D, G, and H. Akane licked B, D, F, and H. And then, only Junpei didn't feel anything. In that case, the container with the antidote is... You know which one it is? Um... Hang on. I need to look at the log again. Yeah, the F is the only one that Carlos yeah. had. Carlos and Akane had, but Junpei didn't. Yes. Uh, yeah. So honestly, yeah. I would pick pick a bad one first. Pick something else just so that the bad ending happens because it's quicker. Okay. The one that's obviously wrong. Yeah. I'm gonna guess we don't need to pick each individual sample, we just need to get a right and a wrong one. Yeah. Oh, why are there six? Uh, Zero said uh, that we'd need a hundred cc's of the antidote. Uh, doesn't that mean that each of those are 50 cc's? No, I'm pretty sure these are 100 cc. Another uh, team has been poisoned. So, uh, mm. There are three left over. Uh, uh, whatever. We got it right. Uh, didn't we, Carlos? Yeah, I'm positive. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because he's wrong. Mm. Uh, hang on, Akane. Hurry, get her the medicine. Yeah, I know. We need to take it too. Right. Okay, down the hatch. It was sulfuric acid. I'm sorry, you guys. Damn you, Carlos. God, the dying faces in this game are really good. <laughs> They're so creepy. Yeah. They go, Daddy. Bye. <laughs> Or aren't you a negative, Nancy? Yeah. So 
save complete. All right, let's go ahead and do that again. Do it again. Do it again. The antidote is. Which mm -hmm. almost wait for it. <laughs> this feels weird. Huh? Weird? D did your tongue go numb, Carlos? Yeah. What about you? Wait, what? Uh, um, yeah, they change it no, every time. Nothing. Oh, okay. I, I think mine were all dummies. So I'm the only one to feel it. Then okay. It's probably. Flop. Huh. Okay. Uh, oh, I, uh -huh, only uh -huh. I felt numb. In that case. All right. Let's go ahead and look at the law. That's not F. Mm mm. Okay, so Carlos did E F G H, so it's not H, it's, it's not e. F, it's E. E. Skip up to where it's different. Yeah. Okay, down. Down the hatch. <sighs> Oh. Okay. No, that's Junpei. Don't go to sleep in the meat locker. I'm really sorry. I just suddenly fainted and No, it's okay. Your plan still saved us. Thanks. Huh. Still, six vials of antidote is kind of strange. Why so many? Hmm. What are the other three for? Now announcing the current casualties. Q Team, Q, Mira, Eric. These three are now deceased. As a result, three X passes will be revealed. I kill. <laughs> I. Fool. <laughs> Q team is. How could they? Even Q. He couldn't even see or hear when. Ugh, to just mercilessly kill someone like that! Ugh. So, I guess that means only us and D team are still alive. Oh, wait a minute. I think D team might be in danger right now. Carlos, Junpei, grab the antidote and get to the lounge. Hey, what are you? No time to explain. Hurry. What could she mean? What I tell you? What did I tell you? <laughs> yeah, you did tell me. These are an antidote. Please drink them, Akane. When Zero spoke to us, I realized something. C team weren't the only ones to be administered the poison. If you do nothing, the six of you will fall asleep. Or wait to never regain consciousness again. Huh. You're right. He did say six back then. Yes, he did. Yes. And now Q team is So the Dying while you're sitting there wasting time. Yup. Everyone on D team. Just hope these actually get to them. Will he even reach them in time? The only thing Throw we can cheese. do now is pray. <laughs> what? That he'll be in time? Or... Or... That he doesn't make it and there'll be six people dead. That's what you meant, right? Junpei! I'm kidding? Oh, God, you sound like my mom. You don't really look all right, Carlos. Maybe the poison's not completely gone yet. <laughs> uh, no, that's not it. You're worried about the D-team, then? Um, Junpei, this might sound messed up to you, but... I, s I saw something earlier, like a vision. A vision? Junpei, your head, it was in the pantry. Just your head. Ha ha ha.
<laughs> That's right. I did it. I cut off my own head. <laughs> Are you smoking, Carlos? <laughs> I'm fine. See? Look, all limbs attached and accounted for. Maybe it was like a prophecy or something. I highly doubt you're seeing into the future. Junpei, you've been there. <laughs> I don't think you're predicting what will happen. It's not the future you saw, but a different past. What do you mean? You know, don't you, Junpei? Morphogenetic field theory. A special field exists in a dimension we can't see that acts as a medium for information. This may be what's happening. I think Carlos accessed that field and saw another history. What? Remember what you said during the vote? You can tell down which path death waits and which is safe. Yeah, but that's just my gut feeling. Are you sure? Where are you going with this? You're a firefighter, right? There must have been countless times when you found yourself facing danger. Better to go right or left. Go upstairs or turn back. Maybe every time you made a decision, you were observing the other histories. Which room held someone needing your help? Which door blocked an inferno? You knew because you saw it happen already. Morphogenetic field theory. Why do you know all this, Akane? Because I have the same ability as you. And Junpei can do it too. He saved me once. It's thanks to his power that I'm even here at all. That was a long time ago. I... I haven't been able to use it since. Even now, I... Interesting. <laughs> Hello. How does it feel to revive from the brink of hell? Zero. Now it is time for you to sleep. When next you wake, know you will have no memory of these past 90 minutes. Pleasant dreams. It's getting really hard for me to keep track of what order these things are happening in. <laughs> I can never remember, like, what time a module started. That was 1810, if I remember correctly. But... I think so, yeah. Alright, guys, that's going to wrap us up for today's episode, because we are out of time. Tune in next time, where we continue on Zero Time Dilemma. See ya! Thanks for watching, everybody. Make sure to click that subscribe button to stay current on all things Duplay. If you really like us, why not support us on GameWisp? We've got lots of awesome rewards for our subscribers, including early access to our videos and exclusive content. Thanks. Catch you guys next time.